All right, here we go. Oh, can't do it. Oh, no. Yep, that's me. A 25-year-old grown man who can't swallow pills. You're probably wondering how I got here. Well, let me explain. Ever since I was young, I was never able to swallow pills. Not only did no one ever specifically teach me, but I just never needed to swallow any pills. My earliest memory involving a pill was when I was at a museum when I was maybe in sixth grade and I had a terrible headache. The chaperone gave me some Tylenol and told me to swallow it, and I didn't know how to do that, so I just crunched it up and had a sore throat for the next week. And from that moment on, I never really ever swallowed a pill. If I have a headache, I will chew up my Tylenol all. If I have a vitamin deficiency, I'll just take the gummy version. However, the older I get, the more it becomes a problem that I can't swallow a pill. Not only do I face extreme judgment and humiliation from every single person that I tell this to, but from a medical standpoint, I'm going to need to learn how to swallow pills because supplements, pill swallowing, vitamins, it's all an integral part of being a healthy person. And recently, I went to the doctor and got blood work and I was extremely low in vitamin D and low in a bunch of other stuff and it kind of scared me. And the doctor prescribed me pills that I couldn't swallow. So I decided I want to document my pill swallowing journey and see if I'm able to overcome this lifelong fear. Here's what happens. Why is it that as a 25 year old man, I cannot swallow a pill? Surely this has to be your fault. Well, you can look at it two different ways. You can look at it like, yes, it's my responsibility to teach you all the things you need to know in life. And yes, I have failed in that life skill. I'm, I'm over here trying to teach you to read, write, say please, thank you, how to ride a bicycle, how to tie your shoelaces. Who knew you had a teach you how to swallow a pill like it's not on the top list of things that mothers need to teach yeah i remember if i had a headache i would take the kids tylenol syrup and that was it and then somehow i woke up and was 20 and was like hey where's the adult syrup and they, they don't have that anymore i don't know how old you were you could have been 18 19 could have been 20. i had to drive you to pick up pills for something whatever it was and i say oh by the way is there a way you could give me the syrup and Instead of like the pill version of this, is there a syrup version? Uh, my son can't swallow pills. And the lady was like, oh, how old is your son? And then I said, uh, 20. <laughs> It is a little embarrassing. I you be 20 and you can't swallow a pill. Because now I feel like it's my duty as your mother to teach you. And you start with like, you know, the sprinkles that you put on ice cream. Mm -hmm. And you start with the smallest of sprinkles. Interesting. That's a great place to start. Thank you very much. All right. Good luck. Okay. So we have the handy dandy sprinkles. I'm thinking which one I want to hit first. We're going to start small. Again, this is going to sound crazy. And maybe people won't even believe me, but I've heard like, Oh, start with a Tic Tac or something. That's too big. I can't do that. What's crazy is I have really bad acid reflux. I take this Nexium 24 hour. Here's the size of these. I cannot swallow these. I have to let these like low key dissolve in my mouth type shit. You're not supposed to do that. Moms always know best. So we're going to start small. Oh, man says a grain of salt. On <laughs> the goal is to be able to hit one of these. I can definitely do this. Yeah, here we go. God. did it. No, that was... Uh, <laughs> boom. That was easy. That was light work. I'm gonna do another one. Here we go. If you're watching this like, bro, this country going downhill. 26 year old man can't even fucking swallow a fucking sprinkle. Hold on. Couldn't do that one. Hey, I did it. Hey. Holy shit. I think it's good we started small because it makes me feel a bit more comfortable. Now I can feel it going down. Like I can feel it. I don't like that. All right, next one. Damn. All right, we'll hit one of these sharks. These are pretty small too. There it is. <laughs> Where is it? Holy shit. That oh one. shit. Hey, got to start somewhere. Mm. We have oh, a. Fuck. These are smaller. Shit, dude. Come on. Dang. But let me try a different because I was trying to move up to these. God forsaken ones. Now, is that a dinosaur? Is that what the fuck is that? That's supposed to be a stegosaurus. Where the fuck they head at? I'm really worried I'm never going to be able to do this. Easy. Nope. Oh, God. Fuck. I did it. Okay. okay. Come on. Come on. Let's go. I grabbed some pills that we have in the cabinet. This is one of Liver King's supplements. And then this is like echinacea for like cold and flu, whatever. Tylenol, Tylenol. I would love to get here. If I can get this, that is going to be life changing for me. If I can get to this one. I don't want to be the person that says I'll never be able to get here. Watch this. I'll do them all right now. Did that one. Okay. 
Boom. Oh star. shit. Come on, let's go. Oh. Okay, here we go, the star. Can do that one. No, because I'm still in there. I'll come back tomorrow. Damn. Like this is funny for y'all, but like it sucks. Like what happens when I'm old? Old people, you know when old people be like they have 20 vitamins to take every day. Like what am I gonna do? This is really like life or death. I'll see y'all tomorrow. So I figured I'd give it a rest, sleep on it, and I had the idea of calling all of my good friends and asking for their advice on how I could swallow a pill. I'm friends with a lot of very talented, smart people, so I figured I could benefit greatly from their advice. I figured you might be the best person to ask this question to. I don't know how to swallow pills. <laughs> you can't swallow pills, my niggas. <laughs> I can't either. I thought I was alone, bro. I really can't. To see my life, I can't swallow pills. You had a bit more experience swallowing than me. You wanted to ask an expert. And how old are you? I'm 30, bro. I'm 30 years old. So I guess you can't help me. I can't help you for shit. Dude. I can't even help myself. Can you please tell me how to swallow a pill? I mean, it's really easy, man. Okay, well, there's two ways. I think loving it really helps. Just loving to swallow. Okay, so the key to swallowing pills, you have to imagine yourself as a productive person because productive people, they swallow a lot of pills. So I grab a water bottle and I put it in my tongue and then I drink the water like that. Chug a lot of water. Think about the fact that whenever you eat food, you're swallowing chunks of food that are bigger than the pill that you're trying to figure out how to swallow. The key is a mindset thing, right? You gotta stop living like a degenerate uh, because they don't swallow pills. All right, that's a big one. A pill of magnesium. I'm gonna show you exactly how I do it, right? This is a problem, because when we get old, what are we gonna do? Chew him, by the way, my friend. And there you go. It's simple as that. But the second way, if you don't have water, Noble actually taught me this at a festival. I do not know what he was thinking. He literally put it in his mouth and chewed it. If you're worried about sealing the pill, maybe fill your mouth with water to the point where you can just drop the pill into the water and then don't try and not let it touch your mouth and then just gulp the water. Warm, like room temperature water and just like gulp it down. Swallow like a nice big one. Yeah, getting it to the back of the throat is really good. I like to tip my head up a bit and let it just slide all the way down to my belly. Put it at the tip of your tongue, put it to the middle, like roll back, then just look around, see who's looking, and then like, like suck it up. And then all at the same time, kick your head back, let it hit the back of your throat. Make sure it hits there and swallow. So that jerk motion was necessary. Yeah, you gotta do that. That's one way to be sure. Good luck, and I don't do any drugs, so stop calling my phone, please. Like, I don't know what you're following. Like, I don't know what you're doing, but yeah, you have a great day, right now. So, we're back. I've made no progress, but let's just get right into it. Let's go for the dinosaurs. I've been telling people about this video that we've been shooting about I'm learning how to swallow a pill. And everyone just laughs. Like, oh, what? How do you not, can't swallow a pill? It's pretty frustrating. Luckily for me, I'm practicing right now and I'm able to get this. Now, let's just wait a minute because it's early in the day. Here we, here we go. Okay. You know, that was with less water. When there wasn't so much water in there, I kind of just pretended it was food. So, that, I mean, that was a dino. Like, come on now, that's progress. Because before, I couldn't even hit the dino. Let's hit the star. Here we go. Y'all think y'all can swallow that? Like, if I pretend it's food. Just did it. Easy. Okay, that was good. That was really, that was serious progress. You know what, I'm willing, to, I'm willing to step it up. I just did a dino and a star. Now we're gonna do a thick star. Okay, here goes nothing. Okay, that was hard. Look, the circular gotta be better. We're gonna come back. That was a little bit of progress. I just defeated these. Now we're on these. See, we are making forward progress. What did MLK say? Even if you can't, if you can't walk, if, if you can look up, you can get up. He says something like that about progress or some shit. I don't care how dark it look for you. I don't care what they done said to you. I don't care what the verdict is. I don't care what the haters say. It ain't over. No matter what happens to you, it ain't over. Ain't no such a thing as over. Do you know, man, that you can actually mess your life completely up? You can jack it all the way up and you can turn around and get it right. Do you know that you can be divorced multiple times and still be okay? Do you understand that you cannot have a degree and still be just fine? Now, whatever you've been through, whatever that is, guess what? You're still here. You have a great life in front of you. But your great life is in front of you. It's not behind you. Everything you're going through, 
is preparing you for what you ask God for. You just got to quit tripping while you're in the process because the process is necessary. You may not see it now, but when he gets you on the other side of it, you're going to see exactly why it went that way. And you're going to be okay with it. Pull yourself together and quit tripping because you're in the process. God is processing you. He ain't through with you. If he was through with you, you would not wake up in the morning. When you feel like giving up, don't. When you're thinking about giving up, don't. When it look like you ain't gonna make it, keep going. When they tell you you can't, come on man, who are they? When they tell you to put all your stuff back on your desk, don't do that man, don't do that. When they tell you you're not gonna make it, don't believe them man. Don't believe them. You got to be relentless. And I'm saying to you, what if all of us took that attitude after we face a rejection and a no or we have a meeting and no one shows up or somebody say, you can count on me and they don't come through. Nobody believes in you. You've lost again and again and again. The lights are cut off, but you're still looking at your dream, reviewing it every day and say to yourself, it's not over until I win. The harder the battle, the sweeter the victory. See, what you become in the process is more important than the dream. That's far more important. The kind of person you become, the character that you build. The So it's been a few weeks, I've been practicing. I wanted to bring Rob here to watch me conquer the pill swallowing. It's been a long time. 25 years. 25 years. Been filming this low key for weeks type shit, but y'all haven't really seen all that. So what are you doing to like practice? I have been doing this technique where I bite my tongue and then that's how I let it go down. I haven't heard of that one. Watch me do it. So this is a small one. This is where I, I couldn't do this at the beginning. So have you swallowed a pill before or have you at least swallowed a sprinkle? I've done a few sprinkles. Well see, that's damn near nothing. <laughs> Pills are actually like way bigger than that, but okay, that's a start, that's a start. Hasn't gone down yet. Boom, that was it. Oh, you got it. It just takes that's me a minute. It. Would you be able to do one of these? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, you're supposed to do the drink too. I haven't done this, this big yet. Okay, let's see. And you did yours with like no liquid? Well, yeah, just because it's so small. So <laughs> No, but you're a beginner. Boom, stop playing with me. We're graduating from the sprinkles now. Here we go, biggest one, big black one. There's a biggest sprinkle in this whole fucking thing, look at that. Come on now. Watch this. Show that it's in your mouth so you're not cheating. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Just to make sure for the viewers that they know. That's it. Well, now so that's it. Final thing was my Nexium. Well, you haven't had an actual pill yet. Well, we're getting to the climax. This is the finale, right? With all the whole video for what? This is it. No, you need like a oh, oh. fish oil pill. Oh, <laughs> we, for the purposes of the video, Nexium. Those are like sprinkles too, I feel like. <laughs> I have crippling acid reflux, so I cannot have low key any food, but especially not chocolate, tomatoes, onions, anything spicy past nine. Don't you guys want to just see him try to <laughs> swallow the pill? All right, awesome, awesome, awesome. <laughs> All right, here we go. The grand finale. Holy shit, that's huge. That's well, a little bigger. Come on, that's huge. That's triple the size. No that's faking, right no bullshit. We don't fake on this channel. This is all real stuff right here. All what you've been working for. All these weeks. Swallow. <laughs> Voila. I did it. I did it. Oh my God, I want to thank God, but most importantly, I want to thank Jesus. That's How it. Phil, you you're a new man. Now that you did that, you're now leveling up. Special day today. Wow, this is actually a big moment for me. Who's gonna bake me a cake in the comments? I need someone to ship me a cake. Yeah, it's to show people that you can do anything you put your mind to, right? That's, That's what it is. That was, that was a, um, the conclusion. That was a conclusion, is like, put your mind to something and you can do it. Even if it's as simple as swallowing a pill.